So KFC Canada has this product now. KFC Mac and Cheese Chicken Sandwich. And I was interested in trying it until I saw the price. Just wait. If I order it on DoorDash, it's $14.49. And I think a different, like, I don't know, Uber Eats, something like that, it was like $17. That's crazy in my opinion. That does not even include fries. Oh, do you want fries? Fries will be an extra $9.69. And gravy is $9.29. Okay, I want to try the KFC mac and cheese chicken sandwich, but I don't want to pay $15 for it. To me, if I pay $15, that should come with fries. I bet you already know what we're going to do. We're going to make our own version, and it's going to be cheaper, and it's going to be delicious. I'm a firm believer in use what you have. I have this mac and cheese. It's a Walmart queso mac and cheese. I don't love it. It's leftover, but I am repurposing it today. I honestly thought I had some Eve's veggie chicken patties, but never mind. I have Eve's veggie chicken nuggets and chicken fingers. So I heated some up in the air fryer. Let's top it with the mac and cheese. I know there's probably some of you out there saying, Jennifer, but that's not Kraft Dinner. Kraft Dinner wouldn't fall off your sandwich like that. I actually thought I had the plant-based Kraft Dinner to try. So I was gonna use that for this, although I haven't heard good reviews at all for it. So I'm okay. <laughs> Let's give this a try. The macaroni and cheese is falling everywhere, but I have a feeling this is going to be really good. Cheers. Mm-hmm. 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 Okay, it's very good. Everything's good here. Bread is good. Chicken, veggie chicken tenders are good. The mac and cheese from Walmart, the queso one, is not it for me. It does not have, it doesn't really have a lot of flavor. It's, it's very mid. So when I make chicken tenders or like Eve's veggie things, I do a combination of mustard and Frank's hot sauce. That is mwah, chef's kiss for me. So I'm going to use that as a dressing. Okay. I poured that all over. Let's try it now. Cheers. Mmm. Oh my gosh. Mm-hmm. That, that made it. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That even redeemed the mac and cheese. That's pretty sensational. Does this taste anything like the KFC sandwich? Probably not. But it's an at-home version. We made it super quick, and we made it with ingredients we already have at hand. It's delicious. Mm -hmm. The mustard and the Frank's Red Hot star of the show. Also, Eve's veggie chicken tenders. So good. Okay, just with the mac and cheese and the chicken tenders, it depends on which mac and cheese. This mac and cheese wasn't great, so I would give it like an okay out of 10. I don't want to criticize Walmart. Like, they're trying. At least it's interesting flavor, but it wasn't for me. But you add the Frank's Red Hot and the mustard, it's a 10. It's a 10. It adds a kick, it adds a flavor, it elevates all the flavors. It's delicious. And we didn't have to spend $15, plus delivery charges, plus all the surcharges. Copycat KFC mac and cheese chicken sandwich. Cheers.